Welcome to Art Happy with Katie. Today we're going to do clay attachments. Last time we made a little pinch pot and this time I'm going to show you how to make some things you can attach to it if you want to spice it up. So I'm going to set my pinch pot over here, putting it on a bin lid. I try to use things around the house so I don't waste and buy too much stuff. So now I've got another chunk of clay and I'm going to wedge it and actually, I think I'm gonna cut it into a couple different pieces. So I'm gonna use my string to cut it. This twine is working out nice. Sometimes I've used fishing line and it kind of hurts my fingers. Ah. Okay. And with these different sizes, I'll show you different things you can use to attach. You can uh, attach. One is, I'll wedge this little bit, one is feet, and adding feet to a pot is just a way to make it a little more fancy. So I'm gonna take this. The pot we made is not very big, so I'm gonna make three feet. Um, and these actually, I think I made it a little too big. Just make a little circle. We'll try that. Take our pot. Oh, that looks too big, doesn't it? I'm going to split it again. And actually, it's good when you, um, if you're going to attach things, you can leave your clay out for a little while um, until it gets something called leather hard, which leather hard is about as hard as when you get a new pair of leather shoes and they're uncomfortable and they give you a blister. That's what we're going for. I'm covering up my name, which makes me so sad, but... It'll be okay. Wedge a little. Get a little circle. I'm trying to get three that are the same size. Hmm. <laughs> Which clearly this one is bigger than that one. Three little feet. That's cute. So now I need to attach them. So the way I'm gonna attach them, I'm gonna take my three little balls and on each one I'm gonna pat it a little bit so it's got a flat surface of the part that's gonna be attached to the pot. And I can't just smush it on there. The reason why is when clay dries, it contracts, which means it shrinks. And so when it shrinks, these feet will shrink and the pot will shrink and the two things will shrink apart. And then you end up with little pieces all over the place. And so what I'm gonna to do to attach them is something called scoring and slipping. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my three little feet and set them over here. And I'm gonna get some water and put the water, oh, I'm covering up my sweet name. Um, but I'm gonna put some water there and I'm kind of rubbing in. You can see it's getting, um, the water's getting kind of chunky. It's getting clay in it. That is called slip. And um, slip is kind of like the glue of clay. Now I'm gonna take a toothpick and I'm gonna do something called scoring. Scoring is when you scratch gently on the surface. What I'm trying to do is convince this clay pot and convince these little feet that they are one and the same there's nowhere that they can uh, pull apart because they're just like really stuck together. So I've got this very rucked up. I did one direction, a second direction, and a third. Now I'm gonna do the same thing on my feet. One direction, another direction, and a third. When I do this scoring and slipping, sometimes it'll accidentally ruck up the side of my um, of, of my uh, feet, but I can fix it later. The good thing is to get a good adhesion. So I'm gonna put that on there. Do it with my next one. And this part can be a little boring, but it is worth it when you don't end up with a bunch of little little balls that fell off. Ah. Oh, 
There you go. Now I'm gonna kinda, I'm gonna put my hand on this side to keep it strong and use my hand on this side and just give it a little push. That looks great. Now I can use my toothpick to kind of smooth that union if it doesn't look great. And now I'm gonna smooth over the other areas where I did scoring and slipping that um, stick out just to make everything look nice and smooth. There we go, feet. <laughs> Thanks for watching, Art Happy with Katie.